Hi there, so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to send Unicode characters with the help of Selenium Java Web Grammar. So we can send this Unicode characters to text box or button or any other interactive element. So first thing, we are going to create driver instance by typing web driver driver equals to new Firefox driver. After that, driver.get and then type in.wikipedia.org. Now I'm going to create web element instance. Then we will find element. I'm going to use by CSS selector and check for body class okay and once we find that element I'm going to send the keys to refresh I'm using keys dot five or you can also use Unicode characters Simply get into double code, then backward slash, then U, capital E, zero, three, five. Make sure that your code is correct. This is the Unicode that we use for refreshing the page. Okay, so let's run the pro project and see how it works. Okay, so it loads our Wikipedia or page and it will send refresh option. So refresh is again. You can have thread dot slip in between to have a particular time delay for this. You can also scroll to the bottom by using another Unicode character which is E00F. Okay, this will take the page down so it automatically scrolls to the bottom. Okay, so it loads the page and, and then it goes for page down action. Okay, so now you see it won't exactly take you to the end of the page but up to a certain point within that web page so if you want to get completely to the bottom of the page then you have to use necessary CSS selector for going it up to this point okay so there are other ways for other characters like page up also for let's see selecting all the pages and few other special characters that you would want to use in text box you can have that with the help of unicode characters so you just have to find that and use it in your send keys method so now you know how to send unicode characters with the help of send keys